why this error code is occurring onto my PS4. When I try to activate my PS4 as a primary PS4, it simply does not let me do that. It simply throws me the error NP3495-9. And what's really going on with my PS4? I keep getting this error. All my digital content, all my games are locked. All the games are locked, which I personally own. So today in this video, I'll be showing you how to solve this issue in a very easy step-by-step -step process. So let's get right into all the details. First of all, let me tell you, you are not alone facing this issue there are tons and tons of users facing this NP3495-9 error. This is a very hot topic as of right now for the PlayStation 4. Many people are reporting this particular error. First fix works flawlessly so let me show you that first of all. I can totally understand the anger of the people. Is the licensing related issue? Alright guys so why this error is occurring is due to PlayStation is not able to access the PSN servers. I checked out the PSN network status. Now I don't know they could be lying but here is the thing playstation network all services are up and running there are multiple reasons why you are getting this error but particularly your playstation can't able to access psn servers either your internet connection having issues the issue lies in one important setting that you need to change and this issue will be gone now this trick found out by a fellow reddit user he's like a god coming to rescue and luckily this process worked out for tens and tens of people it works like a charm the problem lies with your dns so you need to head over to your playstation network settings and and change your dns go to ps4 settings menu select network tab then choose the setup internet connection select whatever you are using then you need to select an ip address settings right over there then choose custom option now for the dhcp host select do not specify and for the dns settings you need to set it to manual so that we can change the dns you can change your primary dns to 1.1.1.1 and secondary dns to 1.0.0.1 but here is the thing guys for many people these dns are not working so let me show you alternate dns that might work out for your region so try this first if this doesn't work then i recommend trying bunch of other dns like google dns so it will be 8.8.8.8 or 8.8.4.4 as a primary and secondary dns or you can set 76 76.2.0 76.76 10.0 but for the fastest experience try this one first this one second and if both of those didn't work then try this third option and after you're done with setting dns do not click on test internet connection and you should be good to go if this video was helpful make sure to hit that like do comment below make sure to hit that like share this video subscribe and